Tamil Nadu Agriculture University is a century old premier institute providing higher education in agriculture. In 1958, it was reorganized as a postgraduate center offering masters and doctoral degrees. I'm happy to inform our university is offering MSc program in 35 disciplines and 29 PhD program in various disciplines. And these are all well received among the students of agriculture and allied sciences. Postgraduate study in TNAU is a very special experience. The School of Postgraduate Studies, a constituent part of Tamil Nadu Agricultural University, is a 60 year old premier institute in offering higher education in agriculture in Tamil Nadu and also to the nation India. During the last five years, the School of Postgraduate Studies have given education to 2,265 master's students and 677 doctoral students. Students from all over India and abroad seek admission at TNAU. International students from Nigeria, Rwanda, Sudan, Afghanistan, Kenya, Botswana and Vietnam have enrolled at this university. My name is Kaiser Bakwasi. I am from Botswana. I'm really happy because I have learned a lot of techniques that I will use when I get home because I'm working as a technician in the Department of Agronomy at the Botswana University of Agriculture and Natural Resources. The PG programs offer choice-based credit system to scholars and provide wide choices of specialization courses to students. These are some of the nano products we presently, uh, it's about to be commercialized. Uh, so some are already been commercialized too, that is released as technology. For uh, say example, uh, this uh, BioGlove hand sanitizer, which is based on uh, uh, nanotechnology, uh, was, uh, we worked with this uh, during the COVID uh, issue so all the research was is based on the need uh, so like uh, say uh, the skirlure which has been presented here we, which we work on uh, hello stem borer as an established research institute school of postgraduate study has many external links not only with other institutes and in the university but also reputed international institutes the strength of the school of postgraduate studies you know, it is on the competent faculty who are very well trained both nationally as well as internationally, well equipped laboratories and also the library with more than 4,000 online journals accessed by the students. Memoranda of Understanding are signed between TNAU and ICAR institutes, SAU and foreign universities for exchange of student and faculty to undertake joint research activities and publications. I'm currently doing PhD in Agriculture and Entomology. Why I choose TNAU? Because this is a well reputed university in India with qualified staffs and also good in agriculture research. I love insects, so I choose Entomology, which, which is a very old department in India. Proud to be a part of this university. TNAU offers the PG programs accredited by the Indian Council of Agricultural Research, New Delhi, which is the apex body of agriculture education and research and facilitate postgraduate students to obtain scholarships and research grants from ICAR, offering new postgraduate and doctoral degree programs across disciplines by considering the scope and importance. The students are admitted through various modes like TNAU entrance examination, ICAR quota and DDP supported GATB MSc biotechnology programs. The pattern raises the education level and competency at higher level, act as never-ending knowledge ladder. Hello everyone, I am Yaifabi Kumam from Manipur, currently pursuing my PhD in Department of Plant Biotechnology, TNAU. Since my graduation days, it was, a, it was my dream to pursue my higher studies in TNAU and I feel very much privileged to be a part of TNAU. 
Thank you TNU for all the knowledge, guidance and support. I feel proud to be tagged with the brand name of TNU. Masters and doctoral programs at TNAU are offered with the framed PG rules and regulations which are set to be flexible and updated time to time. The statutory body to make decisions in PG education matters are Dean's Committee, Board of Studies, Academic Council and Board of Management. Remote teaching is catalyzing a pedagogical shift in how we teach and learn. There is a shift away from top-down lecturing and passive students to a more interactive, collaborative approach in which students and instructor co-create the learning process. The coronavirus, also known as COVID-19, has taken the world by storm and has especially impacted education. School of Postgraduate Studies of TNAU poised to move many or all education resources online to virtual classrooms to ensure the safety of their faculty and students. TNAU is the first state agricultural university in the country to provide uninterrupted education for masters and doctoral students by initiating remote teaching program. Hi, this is Haripya doing my doctoral program in agricultural entomology. Uh, TNU is the dream campus for many of the agriculture students, so I prefer to study agriculture in this uh, prestigious university. The postgraduate students of TNAU have excelled clearing of the competitive talent examinations held at state and national level. It includes Agricultural Research Services, UPSC, TNPSC, ICAR, All India Entrance Examination for Admission, ICAR, All India Competitive Examinations, etc. The School of Postgraduate Studies, SPGS, has facilitated to avail various scholarships to the masters and doctoral students during their degree program. More than 30 forms of scholarship from different funding agencies have been provided to the student. During the 2020 to 2021, scholarship to the outlay of Rs 1.93 crore has been issued through SPGS to the PG students. A series of workshops were organized every year to the masters and doctoral students for training them on areas like career planning, technical writing, big data analysis, advanced statistical methods, and stress management. Students were also sensitized on the importance of quality paper writing and publishing in NAAS high-rated journals. The annual Agricultural Graduate Conference is mainly designed for the young agricultural researchers from various agricultural universities. All agricultural, postgraduate and doctoral students of any nationality who are currently studying in India can participate. About 300 students from various institutes across India and outcome of the deliberations were publishing in journals having NAAS above 6.0 and in high impact factor journals. To make PG students to write their thesis and to publish in the high rated impact factor journals, a separate cell is being established at SPGS, which will undertake language editing and technical editing for the research papers prepared by the students for publication in peer reviewed journals. The duplication of contents in the dissertation, manuscripts, and its integrity are checked with licensed version of plagiarism checker, Authenticate. The engaging culture and the research-driven academic environment act as an ideal incubator that has led TNAU to become an epicenter of agricultural studies in India.